As we await next week's Fed decision, and we are still clearly in the path of rising rates, do interest rate increases usually translate into a weaker stock market? Historically, when rates increase, it's actually good for stocks overall. The S&P 500 has been resilient around the start of Fed hiking cycles in the past. In fact, according to Dow Jones, since 1989 during a Fed rate hike period, the average return for the Dow is nearly 55%. That of the S&P 500 is almost 63%, and the NASDAQ has averaged a positive return of almost 103%. So how may investors navigate the impending rising rate environment? Well, historically, highly profitable, well-capitalized firms perform best when financial conditions tighten. The start of Fed hiking cycles tends to coincide with a strong economy, which can help to lift cyclical sectors such as materials, industrials, and energy. When rates rise, investors may typically see more value in bonds, CDs, and other assets thought to be less risky than stocks. However, history paints a different picture.